Hello guys, it's Catalyst here, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play with Dinosaurs. Um, now last episode we worked on the um, Brachiosaurus enclosure, so if we go and visit him, I think he's hatched now. Okay, now this episode I think I'm going to be um, making another enclosure for a um, saber-toothed cat. And um, that's because I was looking through the DNA test and looking what we've got, and um, yeah, we had that and I thought, well, it seems a interesting enough animal, and yeah, it's going to be pretty cool. So if we have a look at him, how are you? Um, very tall already, and he's only, how old? Zero days old. Oh, he doesn't eat wheat though. He eats cookies, sugar, or apples. Okay, well we can make tons and tons of sugar. Okay, do you sure? Oh, that's to breed them. Ah, okay. So he wants to breed, but now we need to go... Let's go get him some sugar first, make sure he's, um... Yeah, full up. Because we want to make sure all our animals are happy. Um, maybe putting him next to a dead skeleton of his, like, well, not his brother, but his ancestor. Maybe a bit insensitive. Um, not exactly sure. And you're getting big now, aren't you? You're getting very big. Let's have a look. How old is he now? You're four days old. Ooh, you're a very big boy now, aren't you? Yes, you are. I'm wondering when he's going to start trying to kill me. Hopefully not soon. But, um, there's a big chance of that. Um, so... Yeah, so um, let's head back, get um, have us some of that sugar cane, and then we'll make him some sugar. Um, now, I've been thinking about this for um, the past like few um, days and stuff, and I've been since the dinosaur had had an update to 1.5.2, and it's added quite a lot of things. I've been um, thinking whether I should update it or not because if you guys haven't heard in the last video or the video before, it might have been um, if I reset it, I lose all my dinosaurs. I mean, I'll keep my park and everything, but it'll just be... Oh, another one of those things. Uh, yeah, so it'll just be not starting from scratch, but starting from a position in which would be a bit annoying. But I'm not sure if it's worth it. So what I think I might do is I might get to um, a position where I'm happy when I feel like I've got enough dinosaurs, I've done well, um, and then I think I will... Uh, say, yeah, I think I've done enough. Actually, I need to put um, this save to cat DNA that I've got into the um, cultivator to get that starting. Um, how much do I have on that one? 43. That'll do. Start cultivating. Okay, let's leave that in there. Uh, yeah, so I want to get to a position where I think I'm, um, I've completed a, um, yeah, done an objective or felt like I'm in a position that I can stop. Um, now, if you guys have, want to, like, mention what that objective could be, maybe it's to not get a, every dinosaur, or maybe it's to build a massive roller coaster around the park that I've built. Whatever you guys want. But, um, yeah, so as I said, I'm, I'm thinking of updating, because there are a lot of cool things. Like, I think there's a Spinosaurus or something updated in the next update, which sounds really cool. Um, let's have a look. Oh, and now I'm, I'm his owner as well. That's good. And there you go, you're full now. Um, right, so I think what we're going to do while the saber-tooth cat is um, cultivating, I think we're going to um, go get him some snow, because of course the saber-tooth cat isn't want to go. He lives, he's used to the Arctic, so he's going to want some snow. Um, so yeah, we're going to head over to a snow biome, which is over there. And um, yeah, we're going to get collect some snow. Now if I sound a bit weird today, guys, I'm a bit bunged up, so... Um, I apologise for if I sound annoying or anything, but, uh, yeah. So I've already got a iron shovel, that should do, because I'm not, I don't need that much snow. Um, right, so, hello, why is there a cow in the sheep enclosure? Oi! Oh, that sheep was on low health, I just hit it with a spade and it died, oops. Um, oh well, kind of got an overpopulation of sheep anyway. Read again. Um, hello. Um, right, so let's get some wood. We've got some wood. Actually, I'm going to unload some of this, um, um, all these items that I have. Uh, where would this go? Sugar would probably go for food slash plants. Um, what else could I put in here? Sapling and, oh, not fences. What am I on about? Uh, put that, that there. Um, I'll put bit of that in because I kind of want to feed Frank later. Um, what else can I put in? I'll put some of that cobblestone in the blocks because um, 
and not the block. That's not the blocks. Well, so I've got a load of slime balls because I found a um, swamp while I was exploring, so I thought I might as well get some. So, if you guys have any ideas, for any thinking... Oh, God. Cultivation failed. Oh, no, that's not good. At least the DNA is still there. The DNA is still there. That's the important part. And now we've got a pigman. Hello, Mr. Pigman. Wait, he's not... He's not necessarily aggroed, is he? Because he's... Uh, is he aggroed? You aggroed? You're not aggroed. You, you, he can be like my uh, dinosaur butler. You're my butler now, Mr. Pigman. Yeah, you, you stay down here. Guard everything. Make sure everything's okay. You, you got that? Okay, good. Uh, what should I name the butler? He's going to be called Alfred. Alfred. That's a good, that's a good butler name. Right. So, so I also need to make some more cultivators now because it is running. Um, I'm running low. There's quite a few smash now. I think you see I've just replaced some blocks, but um, yeah, I need to stop that. So now I've got a butler. That's quite good actually. Um, right. So um, what was I doing? Boat, of course. Let's build a boat. Um, one, two, three. Um, right and boat. Okay. Now, um, I've been thinking of quite. Um, I've been thinking about the new series that I'm starting. Now, I'm not sure if you guys have seen Hexit. Um, that's a um, series that I've recently started, and that's quite an interesting mod pack. Um, but if you guys, oh, boat not moving. Come on, boat, move. But yeah, if you guys have any other things that you might want me to play through, um, please remember to tell me, and I'll give it my best shot. Um, because I love doing, especially modded playthroughs. If you want me to do a vanilla one, I'm happy to do that as well. Um, because that. Very fu I, I do enjoy vanilla as well. Um, so right, let's just continue going along here. Um, right, there's plenty of snow here. So let's try not to crash our boats. We can use it on the way out. Now, I would like to get some ice, but um, I don't have a silk of touch pick. And I haven't enchanted anything, because in the last episode I died. Um, which wasn't brilliant. I lost a lot of XP. Um, so that was really annoying. Um, so I'm going to have to kill tons more mobs to get that back up, or go mining coal or something. Um, so I'll have to do that as well, uh, before I can enchant. But the problem with ice is, well, if I had a torch nearby, it'd just melt, so it might be a bit un risky. Well, not risky, but a bit annoying anyway. Um, right, so let's just grab all this snow. Okay, my thing is built, um, broken, but that doesn't matter because we can just make enough here. We can make tons here actually. 16 blocks. Actually might need to build another spade but we've got enough. We can make a stone one actually. Um, so let's quickly build a crafting table. Uh, one, two, three. Um, let's place that down here. And we'll build a stone spade because we don't need an iron one. I don't think. And I don't have any iron on me so I can't build one anyway. Let's build two just in case because that iron one broke pretty quickly. Um, Right, grab those snowballs and let's carry on digging this all up. So I do, we do need quite a lot because I want to cover the entire um, enclosure with snow. Uh, with snow. It looks quite nice. And it, I want my animals to be happy, you know, because happy in the environment. Um, they're going to enjoy it. Now, I don't think I'm going to run out of space on the island. Well, not in the um, foreseeable future, anyway, at the moment, because... Um, I seem to be having plenty of space, and it's, um, yeah, and for all the dinosaurs that I'm planning on having, now I'm not sure how many more I have to get, probably quite a few, but I've got two Triceratops, um, I've got Stegosaurus eggs, I've got the T-Rex, um, got the Brachiosaurus, I'm not sure how many are there, there's that weird monosaur thing, but apparently there's a glitch with that, that, I checked it out, and it wasn't me that killed it by punching it, because I didn't apparently punch it, apparently it's a glitch that when it attacks you, it just instantly, like, kills itself, tiny bit depressing, but, you know, uh, there we go, so, it wasn't my fault, which I'm kind of happy about, um, 44, fingers crossed, that should probably be enough, and it's going night anyway, and we don't get mauled by creepers and skellies and stuff, so let's head in. Dun 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 dun. Oh, going, al going along the water, it's fantastic. Um, oh god, I just got out of there in time before a skelly spawned, that's quite nice. And let's land on my beach. Now, I, I haven't done anything with my beach. I, I was thinking maybe I could have like a beach party or 
maybe if where, when I end this series, whenever this may be, um, remember to give me comments on what you think about ending the series on which thing and maybe starting a season two with the new update or I'm not sure how that's going to work. But um, if you guys want me to do that, I could always have like a beach party as a little finale. That could be quite nice. I could have like a barbecue, have Frank next to me. Um, or have all my dinosaurs. Oh, that'd be great. Um, now, why am I heading up here? Oh, yeah, bed. Of course. There we go. Okay. Now, hopefully that um, thing, uh, that saber tooth cat's going to finish cultivating. Um, that hasn't broken yet. Oh, and it's very close to being done. Come on. Come on, you can do it. God, this takes ages. Come on. You can, I, I take it it's going to be when that goes down, hopefully. Yay! Oh, um, yes, of course we're going to need to impregnate it in something again. That I always feel really weird when I say that. I'm going to impregnate, like, a sheep with a saber-toothed cat. That's making me sound really weird. And that should be in there, that should be in there, that should be in there. That needs to be in plants, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Um, right. Okay, yes, another thing that I wanted to um, do, not necessarily a series on, but maybe, maybe a series kind of thing, like a Friday night extravaganza, or maybe a Saturday one. Saturday at the moment, actually. It's good weather outside, um, uh, and that's, like, the first time I could ever say that for Britain. Um, it's, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's almost impossible to have good weather, and we do today, which is, it, it's quite nice. Um, I'm not exactly sure of the exact temperature. Oh god, I'm going to turn my volume down. That's quite annoying. Um, shut up, sheep. Um, now, should I take a sheep? That might be a good idea. Uh, actually, first I need to build the enclosure. That's probably first thing on the list, because I can't really um, impregnate it and then build the enclosure after, just in case it gives birth. And I'm sounding really weird. If someone just started watching this video at this point, uh, it'd be really weird. Um... I think I was some kind of freak. Um, oh, I sh probably should have seen that. I keep blowing holes in my park, which isn't particularly good. Um, so let's just build this up. Um, I'm not going to have enough to completely fill it, but I'll do some. Uh, I'll do some extra filling later. Now that he's getting very big, I'm wondering when he's going to eat me. And now I don't think he should be able to break out of here because I've checked it. the iron bars don't have to be the same. Size him because he can't jump any higher, so he can't get over the too high iron bar. So we don't need to worry about him. Um, right. So where are we gonna build it? Because we are really running out of space here. Um, now, hmm. I've got a big flat space here, but nah. I think we need to leave this open, maybe for a picnic, as I said last time. Hmm. This is getting really annoying now. Um. Oh, and I'm lagging out a bit. Um, right, so where... We could always put it behind here. Yeah, this could work. This could work. Got a nice flat space. Um, now, what I think I'm probably going to do is I'm going to, um, like last time, do a bit of a speed build. Because I think you guys like that. Um, and I think it worked quite nicely. So, an achievement get getting wood. That's because every time I... Um, start my dinosaur thing up, I have to change the files and stuff, and it decides to reset all my achievements, but luckily I'm not caring about achievements, so, you know, it doesn't matter. Uh, right, so what I'm going to do, as I said a second ago, is I'm going to do a kind of speed build thing, and, um, yeah, actually, before I do that, I'm going to head home, quickly get some of my, um, building materials, and then, um, and then we can get started. Right, so let's eat this first. Hello. Hello, Mr. T-Rex. I still haven't named him yet. I I've been really bad at names. As I keep saying, like, every episode I'm thinking of a name for a dinosaur, I need to get, like, a baby book or something. And I never do. I'm just hopeless at this. Um, I, I will, I will do it. Maybe you should be called something like Terence, or, or Terence the T-Rex. I could work, possibly. I don't know. Um, what's a name for a T-Rex? I guess no one's ever had to name a T-Rex. It's never really come up. Uh... Uh, right, so building material blocks, that's where. So we're going to get lots of cobble. And we're probably going to need to get some fences as well. So we we'll need to get some more wood, actually. Um, I've got 17, that might be enough. Uh, I could always just do the wall too... What? 
Oh, not this again. This a really weird glitch that says he's died or escaped because of starvation, and then he's just sitting there like, Hey, hey, I'm fine. Killed a zombie as well, thank you very much. There you go, look, he's full, and that, that was only like two fish. So, he's alright. He still loves me, don't you? Yeah, you do. Uh, can you stop walking off? Okay, right. Stay. There we go. I need to do more. I need to do more. I think me and, like, Frank should have a day out. Because I think Frank's getting a bit bored now. He's like, ah, oh, well, this view's nice, but, you know, it's just it's just not. Getting a bit old now. It's getting a bit bored. So, um, I've got, I've got to go on a day out with him. I've got to, like, fly around. Maybe we'll, we'll land on a beach, have a picnic. Oh, it'll be fantastic. Right. Now, also, you guys, uh, one of you guys noted that my pleosaur had come back last episode, and I thought it must have glitched back, but now I cannot see it again, which is weird. And I'm not sure how they are escaping. Okay, let's leave him for now. He might glitch back, you never know. Um, so, and then we'll just clear out this area. And um, yeah, I'll probably put some music on as I did last time with the speed build, and I hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> saplings um, from the snowy biome, and um, we use them in the English, so that, that can look quite nice. So what well, I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly head back, collect a couple of them, and I'll see you guys in a sec. Okay guys, um, now i got a few more than I would need, i got eight, um, and do I, I have bone meal on me, good, good, right. So let's place a couple of these around the place, just to brighten it up, maybe, maybe putting a pond in might help as well, I've got a bucket. So we could always put a um, pond. That might help liven up the enclosure a bit. It's looking a bit a bit dull at the moment. A bit too snowy. It's just complete snow. Um, so I have to put these in. That See, this is looking much more jolly now. Um, right, one more. And where should we put it? We'll put it here. Um, dirt. That. Okay. Perfect. This is this is looking much better now. Um, so let's go collect a bit more water. 
and um, that's helpful. That's right next to it. Um, let's check a few of these out as well because we don't need. Um, right, and we'll make a small pool of water. We'll put it. We'll put it here. Uh, put one bit there, and put the other bit on this side here. Um, like so, and there we go. Uh, I, I I think that's looking a bit better. Maybe make this a bit more irregular. Oh, didn't mean to do that. And uh, that not cobblestone. That's not going to look good. Um, dirt. Right. Um, oh God. Oh, this is breaking too fast. I kind of messed up my. Unlimited water thing, haven't I? Um, oh well, right. Last block there. There. And that's looking a bit more like a kind of pond. A kind of pond. Probably never heard of that before. Um, right, so please. There. Just trying to get this thing full up. There. And there we go. Oh, no, one more. Okay, guys. Um, sorry about that. I just had a quick crash. Um, now I think this pond, yeah, it's looking, it's looking decent now. So I think we're going to head back home, um, have a quick sleep, do I have any food? Uh, there we go. Yeah, so we'll head back home and um, have a sleep, and then we'll go collect the um, sheep and the embryo. I've already got the embryo, but go get the sheep, because we um, it's going to be the mummy of a saber-toothed cat. That's a bit weird, because uh, you'd think that a sheep would be in its um, predator. Uh, well, the saber-toothed cat is the sheep's predator. But it's also its mummy in this stage. Um, yeah, it's just getting odder and odder as we go along. Um, right, so let's go have a sleep quickly. Oh, I hear a scully. Uh, let's see if we can get into bed. Oh no, where are you? Um, ah, these two. Do I have a bow? I only have two arrows. Don't really want to waste them. Uh, snowballs, I can't really use because not really very damaging. Let's just, let's just go and kill him. Um, this might pay off. We could also leave more monsters to it. I think that's the one problem with this idea. Um, okay, it looks like we haven't caught any monsters long, which is good. Right, let's try and have a sleep now. Um, okay, then all we need to do is get a um, sheep. Right. Um, okay. Right, day? Oh god, there is a hell of a lot of monsters out here. Oh my god. That's a lot of zombies, right? Um, so we're gonna have to try and get them- oh god, I need food. Um, so we're gonna have to try and get the monsters, and not the monsters, the sheep along the, um, side. Well... Okay, now this is going to be, um, a struggling task. Right, so we need to get one out. Get one, no, 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 oh, damn it, now they want to breed two out, two out, okay. One can die. There you go. You're dead. Right, um, you follow. Follow. Follow me. Come on. Why are you not bothered with the wheat anymore? Come on. Yes, that's a good sheep. Uh, actually, I'll go around this side because I have to make a hole in the wall to get it through. Because I've figured out that they can't get through doors. Um, well, even if they're open. I mean, obviously they can't get through doors if they're closed, but, yeah, even if they're open, they can't get through them, which is a little bit irritating. Um, right, so come on. Come on, we're going, you're going to be a mummy today. Come on, let's go. Um, God, the world gen is there. It's not, I hate it when world doesn't generate. Come on, I'm hoping these zombies and stuff have despawned. Come on, Shirley. I think it's Shirley. What? Why? Why did you just... Did you just kill my sheep? Oh, no, 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 no. T turn around, look at look at me while I'm talking to you, excuse me. Why Why did you just do that? Oh, giving me that blank expression. Alright, alright. Oh, now you're looking at me. Yeah, why Why would you... Oh, so, so, such a mean mammoth. Okay. Okay. Operation. Sheep into enclosure. Complete. Accomplished. Whoop. Okay, right. Um, so now, all we need to do is inject it. Okay, you ready? Uh, this isn't going to hurt at all. I'm going to impregnate a sheep. Um, right, come on. Three, two, one. De boom. You're now pregnant. With, you're now pregnant, Shirley. 
and your uh, it's three percent for okay now this is going to take a well not too long but it's going to take a while so um yeah i think i'm going to call it an end for this episode but um yeah it's been a, f a fairly decent sized episode and um i think we've got quite a bit done but um yeah so guys remember to um leave comments about what i should do and um especially about this series and the update i'd be very interested to hear your opinions about it but yeah so remember to um like and subscribe and as always thanks for watching <laughs>